All right, welcome everyone. I'm Destroyer T. Um, and you know what? A lot of people have been commenting like, "Oh, how can I get Windows 10? It's out, etc., etc., etc." Right? Um, and there aren't a lot of tutorials actually showing you how to force it. For example, right? Um, I'm in Europe, so look, I, I've got something like this. You, you turn the icon on, right? It takes like a few minutes to load because it's you know it's quite slow actually, um, but yeah, uh, when it loads, then uh, you can actually see you can see please wait it's loading 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 it actually checks everything if you've reserved it or not etc etc but then you get this right and it's like the 31st and it's supposed to come out on the 29th but what they haven't actually told you is. They won't be doing something like this that, okay, on the 29th, they open worldwide, everyone can download it, etc, etc, etc. Because uh, that would just put a lot of pressure and everything on the servers because everyone will be downloading at the same time, right? Think about it. You know, the, 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 the 29th, right? <laughs> zero, 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 0001, right? Everyone goes instantly and downloads it, right? They'll be kind of crazy and the servers might overload, etc, etc, right? Um, so they're doing, you know, uh, country by country, place by place, etc, etc. Um, but, but, there's a way around it, actually. Um, a lot of people have been actually trying to find a way around it and a lot of people have actually. Um, I'll show you a way around it, but I will not upgrade my PC. I'll show you how to do it, but I will not upgrade my PC because personally, uh, after looking um, at uh, the difficulties with Windows 10, because of the constant updates, right? Um, there might be some problems with, uh, with for example, your graphics cards if you've got dual monitors, etc. Uh, because it actually updates, uh, for example, if you've got a graphics card from Nvidia, right? It updates both drivers from you know all the Windows ones and then all the Nvidia ones, and they sometimes clash, etc., etc. Uh, plus, it's not very good just to get a new operating system straight away out the box because there'll be a lot of bugs. So uh, just like wait a week or two but if you don't want just watch this tutorial and I'll just show you how to show do everything etc etc so if you've got this right don't worry about this at all right um, so just click that right there are two ways how to do it right so first of all uh, you can for example go to this website uh, right here right click on this right um, this is actually in the US right um, and then you can just download uh, download the 64-bit or the 32-bit um, and you're good to go you've got uh, Windows 10 etc right but if you actually want to do it uh, a little bit let's say a little bit harder but then you know everything just goes smoothly through it all just downloads and uploads you don't have to play around with these tools etc etc right um, so what you actually have to do uh, first of all uh, you go into your start menu you go into your computer uh, you go into disk C, you go into Windows, then you go into uh, software distribution, right? And then downloaded. Um, you can see I've got a ton of updates still to do because this is essentially uh, all, all of my future uh, mm, downloads, right? So if you go into your computer again, go into system properties, Windows updates, you can see I've got like three optional, uh, plus I've got one big major one as well, etc. Right, so that's all stored there. Um, so, what essentially you want to do is just delete this whole folder, just delete everything that's in this folder, right? When you delete everything, of course, I'm not going to do it because I don't want to actually download it. Uh, so, you can do it, it's easy it's just to do. Um, just download this whole cache, okay. Uh, just download it, all of them. It won't harm your system. Well, don't worry about uh, stuff like that. Um, after you've done that, right? Um, what you have to do is go to the command prompt. Okay, go here. All right, and then you have to write this in. Uh, sorry, you do v u a u c l t dot exe. Right, meaning execute uh, space bar. The uh, upload uh, update now. Okay, that's what you write. You click enter. Okay, then you'll see here that files will be starting to pop up. All right, uh, that's good. That's good. Don't worry about that. That's good. Um, so when you've deleted this, you write this in. You click enter, of course. Um, then you'll see files will start downloading here. Okay. Then what you do is go here. You go into your computer. System properties, 
Windows update and then you'll see here that it's actually downloading Windows 10 and you're good to go. Um, what does this essentially do when you do, when you you know uh, just delete this and and do all of these steps? Um, well, essentially, I'll show you all the steps here if you want. Um, I, I posted this two days ago uh, on on most of the stuff uh, right here, as you can see. Um, but essentially what it does right because you're in a queue right you're in a queue with the whole wide world just to get windows 10 right um what it essentially does is you skip the whole line and you're first right um so that's that's essentially it right um that's that's the only thing that it practically does uh you, you just download windows 10 it will probably restart your computer a few times you'll upload the whole thing um just warning before you do any of this please back up your system okay uh, I've heard of different instances when they've downloaded Windows 10 um, and there's still a lot of bugs around right um, and you know let's say the second monitor didn't turn on or something like that because it's still buggy please do remember it is still buggy all right um, so just back up your system if you don't like Windows 10 or something's not correct with Windows 10 of course because you know they're, they're still working on it right I'll still give it around a week or two before I'll download it personally um, but yeah, when you get it, actually, right, and everything's fine, you're good to go. Um, if there are any bugs or anything that you don't personally like and you want to go back to Windows 7, uh, you're, you're welcome to, uh, of course. So there's no problem with that. Um, of course, if you're an NVIDIA, uh, let's say, guy, right, that you've got uh, uh, NVIDIA, um, let's say you've got GeForces or something like that, meaning graphics cards, um, then uh, with the new update, if you can see here, um, please do download this as well. You can download it before or after, it doesn't really matter. Um, it actually optimizes your graphics cards uh, for DirectX 12, right, which comes with Windows 10 and for Windows 10, so there's no problem. You can see, getting ready for Windows 10. Um, just That's just an add-on just to show you guys. So yeah, you've got all these steps here. Um, there's no problem. Uh, yeah. And that's it. You're good to go with with Windows 10. If you've got any bugs, just go back to your uh, backup. Wait around two, three weeks whilst Windows, you know, kind of fix those bugs, and then you're good to go. You can do the same thing, um, or actually, maybe your country will, you know, pop up, and you can just do it through the panel here. Um, right so it doesn't really matter of course when you'll be also downloading um, Windows 10 and you'll skip the skip the thing you will probably see it here some people do see it here some people don't see it here but for sure when you go into your computer system properties Windows updates you'll see it here all right um, if this method might not work in a few countries just saying okay uh, because they may have not released uh, Windows 10 in a few countries fully so please just be aware of that um, yeah and hopefully it works for you guys um, and hopefully you won't have any bugs or anything like that just have a backup just in case hopefully you like this uh, short little episode showing you guys how to actually get Windows 10 if you or, you know at the back of the queue or in the middle of the queue or still in the queue doesn't matter hopefully you guys liked it all right and just like subscribe uh, and yeah just share this video so that other people can actually see how to get windows 10 hopefully you enjoyed see you guys